Hello, my name is Jim Pen. I'm in Lapierre's group in, at McMaster University. Um, my project is to find out low resistance, low resistance front contacts for nanowire solar cells. Because in 35 nanowire solar cells are um, the third generation solar cells using semiconductors, nanowires that have excellent light trapping effect. And to reduce the shadow loss and the maximum the light absorbed by the solar cell, we need to find a uh, very uh, transparent, high, con high conductive solar cells, a uh, con contact layer. Um, uh, tra the traditional contact layer is a nickel germanium gold layer, but uh, nickel germanium gold is uh, opaque, so we cannot use it in our concentrated PV. So we decided to use the uh, ITO, which has a very high transmittance in, in, in visible light, and, uh, it, and it has a uh, very good contact with semiconductors. So in our, in our modeling, we, this is the contact resistance of, um, uh, that, that way influence the efficiency of the solar cell. So the way we use it to fabricate the uh, device is uh, we, dis we, sp uh, we spin coat a uh, circulating layer on, the, uh, on, on our nanowires to, to support, to get a planar, to, to support the planar contact. Uh, the second step is uh, we, because we want to contact as, as many nanowires as possible, so we etch it, etch it back with uh, oxygen and CF4 in our eye system. Because we, if, if we don't sonicate, the, because the wires have different heights sticking out of the secretin, so, so if we don't sonicate them off, the, uh, in sputtering, the, the, uh, the ITO will form a like, ball, ball shape on the top of the tall wires. So, so we decided to sonicate them in DR water to get the top of the wires off, and we sputter with a uh, ITO layer, uh, we usually do like between 250 nanometer or 500 nanometer ITO on the top of the on the top of our device. Um, you can see from this SEM image here, they, they form a very very smooth surface on top of the, of the wires. The result we we've got is we got um, like a, uh, almost eight times 10 to minus three. On um, um, centimeter squared, uh, specific contact resistance at three volt bias, and uh, the sheet um, resistance we we found is uh, less thirty ohms per square for five hundred for five hundred nanometer thick ITO, and uh, the transparency is eighty five percent. We are going to improve. Uh, we ha so far the. Um, the contact, re re contact resistance is not still not, not uh, ohmic, but uh, we're going to try something new to make it ohmic and uh, get a very low resistance. Now between the valence and conduction bands, you've got a forbidden gap. And if the gap you've got is just too wide, you'll lose your photons in a snap. Now if the gap you've got is far too narrow, you'll catch the whole darn fleet. But that won't do you any good, cause all you'll get is heat. Oh, solar energy, yes, solar energy We can have our fun with the power from the sun Using good old PV 